Hi guys! Um, I saw from my last videos that you really liked this setup. I'm not sure whether it's just the setup or the lighting because I've started using my box lighting. Um, even though there's natural light outside now, um, my front room just doesn't... I don't know, it's just not as good as the fake lighting at the moment. Maybe in summer I might start going back to the normal lighting. Um, so I thought I would use this setup again. Right, so I thought I would do a what's in my bag video because I got a new bag at Christmas and I haven't done one of these for quite a while and I love watching these videos. It's mainly for the little bits that are in people's bags when they pull out the receipts and the chewing gums. That's the kind of thing I'm fascinated with. What kind of crap do people carry around? So um, I thought I would do one and this is my bag. I showed you it in my Christmas haul. Not my Christmas haul. Yeah, what I got for Christmas and it is a Fiorelli one. I think that you get these from Debenhams and it's just a leather black bag like that. So I will show you. First of all, there's like a little pocket at the back, so I'll just see what's in that. Ooh. Huh. Bonus, that is one good thing about doing videos like this. I've just found £3.40 in that little pocket, so I'm very happy about that. Uh, mainly in that little pocket, I generally keep either my house key and a few little bits. So what, what have I got here? I've got a business card for a wedding dress shop a, what's this, when it also another time when I went wedding dress shopping they wrote down the dresses that I liked, I've also got a business card for Dawson and Sanderson's uh, you know, travel agents because this is where I booked my honeymoon and this is Shelley who did my honeymoon and also this which a friend gave me a couple of weeks ago, it's like a little torch for your purse you do it. It's just one of those like little. It's like a little torch for your purse, but it's a flat one, so I just keep that in the back of my bag. Okay, so on the inside, I have two compartments, which is great because I stick all my like rubbish at the front and all my like money and phone and important things at the back. So if I do the rubbish section, oh my god. So first of all, I've got like three magazine type things in here. I've got the Dare magazine, which is Superdrug's free magazine, and I haven't read that one yet. I also have the Tesco magazine that my mum gave me the other day, which I think is great because they fit in your handbag. And I like getting food ideas and what's on offer and all that. And I have my Slimming World book. Uh, this is my old one. I'm transferring the info from this one to my new one. So I always carry that around with me in case I need to look at sin values for food and things like that. I also have this giant, very sexy bottle of E45 Itch Relief Cream and it's because of my hands, um, I showed you them last week, they're really sort of sore and red, in fact that looks really really bad, um, they're extremely itchy so I haven't used this yet, I just put my bag the other day so that will be for when my hands get really really itchy. I also have a Slimming World Hi-Fi Bar, um, which is like a they like cereal bars, but they're like low in calories and stuff, and one that I've eaten and one that I will eat in a minute because I just realised I was there. I have some girly bits that you have in your bag from time to time, but I won't need to show you that. <laughs> and I have a bunch of glosses and stuff, so what have I got? Yeah. God, i got a few. I got this as a, was it a Christmas present? Yeah, it was part of, it was part of a Christmas present, and it's one of these Vaseline little cases. Ooh. And if you flip it open, there's a little Vaseline. I haven't used that yet, but it's in my bag for when I need it because it's got a handy little mirror. Um, I have a Revlon Lip Butter in Macaroon. I absolutely love this shade. No one ever talks about this shade. Um, so I'll just show you it then. It's just one of the darker ones. I absolutely love this. And it looks like that there. I absolutely love Macaroon. So I carry that around with me because they're just quick and easy to slap on. I have a Barry M Lip Gloss in... I don't think there's number 11 which is like this coral one I haven't worn this very for quite a while because it's more ugh, it's from hair. It's more of a summer shade but I absolutely love the consistencies of these glosses so I carry that around because sometimes it just looks nice on a darker lipstick I also have a very random dark colour a Too True colour drenched lipstick in shade 5 which is a very very dark lipstick I wore this on a night out and I think I just chucked it in this bag I don't think I've actually worn it since but I do love it, it's more from a night out though um, I also have a lip balm, it's a Burt's Bees Honey Lip Balm, I absolutely love these, I've got a few of them lying around. Um, oh, I absolutely love the smell of the honey ones, so it's just a lip balm, 
absolutely love it that I always have hanging around. And this is another one I got for Christmas. It's the Ravishing Raspberry W7 Lip Balm. It's one of these tin ones that you just <laughs> slide out like that. It smells really, really nice. I used it the other day because my lips were getting a bit chapped. Um, I don't know how good it is in terms of moisturising, but it's just a nice quick colour just to slap on. Alright, so that is the front of my bag done. <coughs> Compartment 2. Right, so one thing I've had with me every single day is my Kindle. I've, um, I haven't put it up yet, or I might have by the time this has gone up, but I've done a what's on my Kindle blog post. I didn't see the point in doing a video on it because I haven't read all the books on here. I've only read one or two of the books on here, so I've done like a blog post, but this is it. It's just a cheap leather case that I got from eBay, and there's the really cool screensaver. Um, but I've been carrying this with me every single day in my bag, and I've been reading it at work every single lunchtime, so... Loving that. Um, what's that? Paycheck, because I got paid last Monday. Two packets of tissues, because you just need tissues at this time of year. I have I had a cold a couple of weeks ago, so I always keep these in my bag, which are handy, because someone got really upset the other day, and I had some tissues. The other problem is, when I gave them to her, I thought, oh no, they're Balsam ones. So she was like rubbing them in her eyes, and I was like, mm, they're going to make her eyes sting, but I think she was alright. Um, I also have a hand cream, this is one of the Crabtree and Evelyn hand creams. I always have a hand cream in my bag um, nowadays. I think for the last couple of years I've made sure I've always got one. Very, very handy. Bits of bus receipt. Got to catch the bus last week. Another bus receipt. Another bus receipt. So I think I've caught the bus three times this year so far. And this is a, what do you call it? It's like a spa price list. So I'm going to a spa in a couple of weeks because Martin got me, his mum and his sister, a spa day. And I also bought my mum and sister the spa day too. So we're all going to the spa in two weeks' time, something like that. I also have in here a little notepad that I got for Christmas. I think it came with this bag. Not with this bag, but as in the, the, the person who got me this bag, I think, put this little notepad in it. So it's just a cute little notepad. So if I've ever got any ideas for blogging and stuff, I can pop it in. Um, I also usually keep my phone in here, but... On the weekend, my phone's usually out of my bag because I haven't left the house this weekend because it was snowing and it, I can't be bothered. And last but not least is my purse. This one I got for my birthday last year. And I absolutely love it. It's just sort of, what is that? It was weaved somehow, but um, just a nice little brown purse. I'm not going to go through it because I did do a what's my purse last year and it's the exact same stuff. So I've just got like my Boots card, Debenhams card, Holland and Barrett card. Superdrug Beauty card, Body Shop card, and a Matalan card. So these are all like my store cards. Um, I don't have any of the credit card store cards. These are just points ones. I don't do credit cards. Um, then I have my driving license, which is covered up by a Tesco Club card. Um, my account, joint account, Tesco Club card. And what's that one? Nectar points when I go to Sainsbury's. I've got my European health insurance card, which ran out two years ago. <laughs> And another sort of shop card, which is like a VIP shopping one. And then, do I have anything else? Oh, God. Loyalty cards for, like, food places. A JTF membership card. You've got to go down to JTF. There's so much, like, makeup and food and everything down there. Um, another restaurant card, restaurant card. House of Fraser card. These are overspills. A pub card for the George Inn in, um, where's this, Aylburton. So it's the um, George Inn and Millingbrook Lodge. It's amazing. What have I got here? A boots receipt. What did I buy? An FC UK Manfield Comfy. I have no idea what that is. I think it was when my boyfriend bought the gift set at Christmas. So I think he gave me the receipt. Oh, yes, to get my boots points. 10% off, which was £30 of boots. That ran out. And then I sometimes a cap. Oh god, there's so much rubbish. I'm quite surprised actually because I think compared to how I was last year, I've got less rubbish in it. But um, saying that, I've got quite a bit of rubbish in it. Ooh, I have some money. I have a fiver. Exciting. And then in the front bit is where I keep all my change and like some more random little things. I've got my dentist appointment there. Um, I've got a business card for a DJ for my wedding, so I need to have a look at them. I've got. I think I've got £8 on this Republic card that I need to spend. Uh, that's where I get my hair cut by Jacqueline, or Jacqueline, I always say it. 
Um, and then I've got some money in the front and then another boots receipt. Oh, it's a boots voucher for 507 skincare, which ran out yesterday, or ran out today. And then I have about two quids worth of change, and that is about it. Oh, look at this. One got me ages ago. It was like a little tortoise keyring. So I hang it on there because I had nowhere else to hang it, so it's like a little tortoise keyring because I have tortoises, obviously. Um, so that is what is in my bag, and once again that is my bag, I really like this because it's quite a small bag because usually I carry quite a big bag and I think that's why I usually have a lot more rubbish around it but I think this one looks a bit, ooh, it looks a bit, I don't know, posher, not posher. I look a bit more grown up in this bag than I do with my like, my other bags but you know what I mean. So um, yeah that is what is my bag, I hope that hasn't been too boring, please link yours below because I absolutely love these posts and people are doing them quite a lot at the moment and it was, um, I asked on Twitter, Miss Budget Beauty said just do this one, I thought yes I need to do it so. Yep, I will see you in my next video and I hope you like the setup because I did get a lot of good feedback from it so um, I'll try and do the setup from now on or if not the setup at least use the light so yep hope you enjoyed it and bye.